Hello and welcome to Letty Blue Sagittarius. Thank you for visiting my channel. This is your current reading at this time. I'm going to go ahead and make a noise just to clear the cards here. Okay, Sagittarius. If this is your first time at my channel, thanks for clicking on my channel. For those of you who are subscribed to my channel, of course, thank you so much for coming back. Okay, we're just going to see what your challenge is right now and what's unseen and what your focus should be at this time. Okay, Sagittarius. And see if we can get some advice here, okay? So let's see what the challenge is for our Sagittarius at this time. Okay, we have gift, souvenir, promotion, delight is in your challenge. Okay, what's unseen? Strategy. Okay, so something we have to work through, planning, prediction, mind reading. Okay, and focus, savings. Okay, so the focus should be on savings, preservation, collecting, collection, and meanness. Okay, whatever the meanness may mean. But anyway, maybe greed, who knows what that, what that means. But And the advice libation donation pray religion okay so you might be working on um some things when it comes to your spiritual life okay so we have gift strategy savings and libation 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 and libation i don't know i'm a new yorker sorry but anyway um hopefully i pronounced that right but let's see okay what the tarot has to say when it comes to what your challenge is and things of that nature right now okay keep in mind Sagittarius I have already shuffled these cards for you okay we're gonna get one more shuffle here for our lovely Sagittarius okay I don't want this to fall so I'm just gonna put these right there okay Okay, so what is our challenge here? Okay, our challenge is when it comes to something here, when it comes to maybe a promotion or whatever this gift may be, you are really thinking about a new path, doing some type of research or whatever this is in your life, whatever gift this is, you're really thinking about it and really... um wondering how you're going to go about this situation okay when it comes to this card here okay with this page all right um so let's see or you might just be you know um you're just really studying something and something new for you okay when it comes to this challenge and you're really thinking about it what's unseen unseen we have um the nine of pentacles in reverse Okay, and that's meaning really we need to look at our finances and, you know, our, our stability when it comes to um, strategizing how we're going to work our finances, okay, um, for what's unseen, okay, making sure that we really look and do research on how to move forward when it comes to money, okay, it seems like we're thinking a lot already about, you know, um, when it comes to money because there's two money cards here okay what's the focus here the focus is is that it's a lot going on in your mind okay and it's really like troubling you at this time okay it's either you're like really trying to you know get out of your mind about it um you're feeling insecure in a certain way and you know you're really looking at what it is you know what your future opportunities and it's just something you know you're thinking about you know when it comes to your savings you're like this is something your stability you you're really in your mind about it and you really need to calm down when it comes to that okay but just to make sure that you strategize but don't overwork yourself okay yeah so when it comes to the Ten of Swords, it's definitely something that has got you, like, really feeling like, you know, like you've been stabbed in the back, really. Or, like, it's got you, like, it's betrayed, some type of betrayal here, okay, when it comes to, you know, um, 
donation or something like that. Okay, um, but it's a weird feeling, uh, it, but the worst is over, okay? So it came in reverse. Both of these came in reverse. So it seems like there's some things that are actually, you're really contemplating about it. And you're really thinking about it, but the worst is over. So it's like this is upside down. So the swords could be coming out of your back. Okay, and then there's a new beginning here with this page of swords. But it's actually something that is really, really uh, troubling you. Okay, but let's get some more clarity here. Okay, Sagittarius. Yeah, it's something that is making you heartbroken at this time. You have the Three of Swords, so some type of loss at this time, okay? Something is really hurting you, and you're feeling like things, um, you're really down on yourself because you think, you're thinking that things are not really progressing the way they should at this time, okay? But you have the Empress and you can turn these cards upside down and you can heal from these energies if you continue to move forward. Just know that the worst is over, okay? And just have faith in what is happening in your life, okay? And continue to take the time out to rest yourself. Yeah, and you have this, you know, your focus should know that, you know, when the Eight of Wands comes up, there should be, you know, some quick energy coming in or some, some quick news coming in or even some travel when it comes to your savings, some information that's coming in. It could, you know, involve work or something like that. This definitely looks like it's more of a work issue for you. But you do have the Eight of Wands, and it looks like things are advancing, and you do have a 10 here. So it's definitely an and a 9. So it seems like, you know, things are advancing, but they're just coming in slower, and you just really have to really strategize when it comes to whatever problems that you're having. Yeah, because it's like a stagnant energy here, and it's like, okay, you feel like you cannot control certain things. Things are out of balance okay for you because the chariot is all about you know um moving forward but you probably feel like you know your heart is dropped when it comes to this okay because you're feeling like things are just not where you want them to be at this time okay it's a sense of you really needing to nurture yourself also um with these threes here okay and think about you know, um, collaborations and stuff like that, okay? But let's see what else we have. Okay, you do have a new offer that might be coming in when it comes to gift. You have two pages here, okay? It might be some type of offer when you have to choose because you have two pages here, okay, in this challenge area. So you might have two different offers, or two different new directions that's coming into your life. And you have another fast energy here. So something that's unseen when it comes to, you know, um, your career or when it comes to work is something that you really need to pay attention to, okay, and make sure that you're going down the right um, direction because this is a fast moving fire energy and it's all about strategy at this time as well yeah okay so you have the hangman you know in reverse so it's definitely some things where you need to see things you know um more clear okay in your life at this time and to get as many perspectives although you've been waiting for a while you just need to um, stand up and really, you know, get the rest that you need. Wake up to what it is that you really need to do and, you know, move out of the energy of, you know, uh, this hangman energy, okay? Being stuck. All right. And the seven of cups. Yeah, yeah. There's been a situation where you probably was like had different options and you probably was stuck, you know, in this fantasy world where you might be getting a light on what to do now. But your options were kind of like creating like where in the world do I go with my situation? 
at this time? How do I move forward? So you probably were at a halt for a while and now you're really trying to figure out what to do. Okay, and on the bottom is the Ten of Wands and that's another Ten with a new beginning. So you're thinking about dropping some things because your load has been so heavy and you just might need to delegate some of that energy to some of these three energies on collaborating with something or, you know, um, some type of people in your life. If this is resonating with you at this time, if you can give me a like, Sagittarius. Okay, this can be not only a work issue, it could be something personal in your life that you really are thinking about at this time. Okay, can I get one card of guidance for our lovely Sagittarius here? It's not an easy time for you right now, Sagittarius. Okay, we have fertility, rabbit. So that's the same thing as the Empress, basically. So whatever it is that you're strategizing on, um, it's about you progressing, okay? But it needs some type of movement in your life, okay, to move forward. Although you feel like, you know, um, you're tired and restless. It's like when you get to the Ten of Wands and to the Ten of Swords, it's like a whole new beginning. And these two new pages, these choices, it's like a new beginning to really follow your gut on what it is, even though, you know, you're here thinking about what it is you want to do. Um and what you're stuck at is all about you being more fertile in what it is you want to do. Let's get a manifestation card for our lovely Sagittarius here. Okay, all greatness teeters on whether a would-be hero overcomes the terror within and advances regardless. Yeah, you have a lot of advances here in New Beginnings. With this Chariot and with this Eight of Wands, these are all fast energies here. And these are endings here with these Tens here. They create a One later on, so you start again, okay, with these Tens. So it's all about, you know, you really strategizing and going with the flow on what it is that you may not feel confident about, okay? It's all about you having so many options, okay? But it's all about between the two choices here, you just really need to focus on, you know, which one, okay, you need to choose, okay? It might be a competing energy here, but um, either way, you know, you're going to move forward because you have this eight of wands, okay? And so you, you don't need to strategize for too long because then you'll be stuck like this hangman for a longer time. And you don't want that to happen, okay? You want to be fertile, okay? So that's what you really want to look at all at this time. And let me get three more last cards for you. And these will be your clarifiers. Okay, so I'm seeing four cups. Okay, there's a sense of you not being fulfilled. Okay, but there's opportunities around you. So you need to keep looking. Okay, and don't get so caught up um, in not seeing everything around you. Okay, really look at your opportunities. Okay, another one, Seven of Pentacles. Yes, you've come a long way in your life and you're ready to see your harvest. And it's just a waiting period, but, you know, um, this pause needs to be moving forward at this time. A decision needs to be made. Yeah, here's a decision with the Two of Wands. So plan to move forward. You have choices. Okay, Sagittarius? Okay. Sagittarius, if any of these um, actually, you know, resonated with you today if anything in this reading resonated with you today Sagittarius if you could please give me a thumbs up I'd appreciate it and I'll see you on your next reading Sagittarius take care bye